right? Science fiction into reality as students use robotics to ready themselves for the future jobs of a brave new world. That's in today's What's Cool at School. It may look like a classroom, but the environment is that of a busy boardroom where the future of engineering and robotics is discussed and debated. Learn more about robotics, learn about programming, learn about the uh, business world with uh, the corporation roles. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. These small groups are actually student-led corporations with a board of directors, specific objectives and job titles, and the teams direct each other to a role where they can shine. When I came into this class, I explored different areas here. And I later learned that I am actually a programmer. When we work together as a team, we're able to accomplish things quickly and more efficient. You won't find these scientific minds quietly perusing a textbook. Actually, I don't use a textbook, and I actually don't like using a textbook. This is a hands-on, proactive approach. We come through a process called trial and error. It was better off for us that we were able to do the hands-on approach, that we are able to learn while we're building. And build they are, creating robots that can dance, go through mazes and fight like a sumo wrestler, metal robots that scoop and shoot balls, to using Legos to design and build amusement park rides. We thought that we would do a roller coaster to begin with, then a Ferris wheel, and then a teacup ride, but we finally uh, ended up with this ride. They're learning the fundamentals of STEM and striving to prepare for the jobs of the future, many of which don't even exist yet. All of them really picked this class. They see the future in it for themselves, and they just love doing robotics. They want to be in the future of engineering robotics. It helps me prepare for the upcoming world. I definitely want to be a computer software engineer when I grow up as a career. They're already writing business plans using advanced computer systems and challenging themselves with a 3D robotics competition called Skybot. The most fun part is probably the competitions, getting to show off like this is what I made to uh, friends and parents, it's really fun. As I often encounter when doing this segment, I found kids that love learning. Now that I got into robotics, I love it. I absolutely love it. And that's what's cool at school.